Welcome to the gala opening of the Jews in Modern China exhibition hosted at the beautiful Nanotechnology Center building at bar -Ilan University. What will be discussed here in this exhibition that will be presented in the next three months in three communities in the past hundred years. So the first community was in 1840. It's a Baghdadi Jews. The second group came from Kharbin and the border of Russia. And the third group that is presented here is during World War II. For the cutting of the ribbon ceremony that we officially opened the exhibition to public, I am pleased to invite to the stage Mr. Kung Dan, Mr. Tsai Wei Ming, Professor Pan Guan, and Mr. Jonathan Shen, Professor Rabbi Daniel Hershkovitz, Professor Ariet Saban, Mr. Tzvika Ziv, and Mr. Ran Peleg. לנו כיוצאי סין זה מאוד מעניין לראות את התערוכה, זה ככה מזכיר לנו נשכחות. זה מרגש אותי מאוד לראות שיש, שהיום מדברים על היהודים בסין כי אני חייתי איתם כל הזמן והייתי חלק מהם ואני חושבת שזה חשוב מאוד כי לא מדברים על זה מספיק. קודם כל זה באמת מקום באמת להנציח את ה, גם את הפיסה הזאת בפאזל היהודי הגדול שאומנם הוא קטן, אבל הוא נותן את הצביון, את הניחוח, את הצבע ואת הקול של יהדות נוספת. As a Chinese, I am proud of this, because you know, this is a symbol of the strong relationship between China and Israel. It's only the start, and we are on the way for a very strong, very strong relationship with China of Bar-Ilan University. in particular, and of course the state of Israel. The, both the Chinese people and the Israeli people, they, they share a lot of uh, similarities. And they supported each other and helped each other in the, in the history. And uh, this is why this exhibition is happening here. The strong and robust friendship between our two peoples lays solid foundation for bilateral ties between our two countries. Today, Sin was a very successful relationship with us. I see that this is going to be a long time. So a Chinese saying I think would be appropriate to express the direction of our relations is real gold does not fear the flame of the fire. In other words, these relations, strong relations, have yet the full potential to reach and continue to that direction. We need to remember that the relationship with Sin is going to be a part of the society of the academy, and I think that you are going to see the way. And the great news is that these two people, the Chinese people and the Jewish people, never let the politics get in the way. And now, as we have free ways of commerce and information, and uh, education uh, increasing by leaps and bounds. I'm honored to call to the stage Professor Eric Zaban, Mr. Jonathan Shen, Dr. Alfred Banner, Mr. Jin Xin. I still remember how I was shocked when I realized the uh, Holocaust and uh, how I was moved by the relationship between Jewish people and Chinese people in Shanghai and when I came to know Professor Pan Guang. The Jewish community of Shanghai will not be what it is today if I hadn't met Professor Pan. So today I will not read a long paper, I just show you a photo. I want to show you, we said uh, five waves of Jewish immigration to China. Thank you so much, Professor Pan. 
We thank you greatly for your talk. We highly esteem your long life dedication to the study of Jewish people. We are truly privileged to have you as our culture and heritage translator to the Chinese people for so many years.